a morning sunrise. The restless stir of wildlife as a breeze whispers serenity through the hills, all just a click away. Landtrust.com is connecting people to moments at places like Shady Lane Farm in Bartlett, Kansas. We live in Southeast Kansas, right here on the Kansas-Oklahoma border. Jennifer Mathis and her husband farm several hundred acres of pristine Kansas land. We farm uh, your typical wheat, corn, soybeans. We also have a certified seed company that we sell seed to uh, other farmers. Um, we also raise a hay grazer. The land, you know, being able to farm here and to see our dream of farming and being able to provide that food um, is important to us. Managing that dream is part of the job. So is caring for the wildlife that comes with it. So on our farm, you can find a lot of turkey and uh, quite a few deer. We also have three or four fishing ponds that you can find a lot of catfish and largemouth bass. And now, thanks to LandTrust.com, they're sharing it with others and making extra profit for the farm. Most landowners have a resource that they make some use of, you know, whether it's, you know, an egg production is a typical one. But there's more to it than that. You've got an asset sitting here that has attributes that can be marketed that are not. You're already paying the taxes, you're already, you know, taking care of things. Why not maximize pulling some other off? Land trust is not a lease. That is just not what Land Trust is. And they're setting up their own deal. They have 100% control of uh, you know what happens, the process. We don't have a contract. You know, you can sign up in the morning, put your place on, change your mind that afternoon. No harm, no foul. There's you know no problems. We just take our percent, and it's very reasonable. Last year, Americans spent 17 billion dollars on recreational land access. Forecasts predict agritourism to grow at an annual rate of 13% in the next five years. That's a demand resourceful farmers can use to earn extra money simply by sharing the beauty of their land. They can book one to two days, three days a week, whatever that they would like right there. You set your own prices, and so there's not a set price. I don't have to maintain a certain number of bookings. Um, I can go in on the calendar and mark off days that we don't want to offer uh, any hunts or anything like that. And so the landowner really has full control. Matha says they're selling two things, access and memories. It's a quiet that you just don't understand. There's a piece about it that um, you can only know if you've experienced it. The stars are just absolutely amazing. and. You can visually see the, the Milky Way. Um, you can hear the frogs down at the pond and you know, just kicking back and relaxing is um, something that we can offer. I grew up in the city and being able to be out in the country is just an experience that people need to have just to be able to relax and soak up the sunshine and not have pavement underneath your feet. And it's important that people are able to escape, have that little escape and to be able to come on the farm. And that's something that Land Trust is able to um, help us with. The pandemic definitely, I think, helped because it jogged people into a different way of vacationing and a different way of handling their spare time. You know, Disneyland was kind of out and a few of those big deals. And they were starting to look at, maybe we can go camping, we can go fishing, you know, do something like that, do a family function that doesn't involve, you know, bright lights, glitter, and everything else that goes with it. Something that's very real and people got more connected. Uh, so I think that there is a great future. At the Mathis Farm, that future includes LandTrust.com and access to places and moments worthy of sharing. There's very limited hands-on and there's really no capital involved in it. It's a bonus for Land Trust and it's a bonus for the hunters. To learn more about how you can enroll your land with Land Trust, scan this QR code and take the first step in adding recreation income to your operation.